everyone, and welcome to the Stock Swoosh Show Play of the Day. This is EDU. I like this gap this morning. This was my top pick, and it worked. And in fact, it actually swooshed today. I uh, wasn't anticipating that. Uh, however, I'm really glad that I stuck with this today. It was a nice trade. And depending on how many times you did this today, uh, some people have just really big days here in this. Let's just go over it. First of all, I saw this in the morning. I got up and I rated it like I always do. I have my rating system, which is the 26 points. I get up in the morning, I look through my gaps, I decide what I like and what I want to watch and rate, and then I rate them. I actually only rated two things today, although there were quite a few gap downs. Both of the things that I liked today ended up working. However, I only did one, which was the EDU. But you could have done both things, and I think some people in the room did do two things today. Uh, but I just stuck with the EDU. I rated this EDU right around here. Because that's where it was gapping this morning. When I woke up bright and early. However, the stock ended up opening all the way down here at 21.96. So that's very unusual. Usually if you see a gap in the morning and you're watching it, it may change slightly from the time that you read it. But it actually changed a lot uh, from the time that I rated it. It didn't matter. It still was a nice gap. And you do have to check these. You do have to check them. And if you rate the gaps at night, you have to go back and check them in the morning. Now, the stock was strange in the morning. Something actually, I saw something today that I never saw before. Uh, this was very unusual, and I've never seen it in six years of trading. But, you know, you trade for a long time, and you're going to see everything at least once. I'm pretty sure of that. So now that I've seen this, I'm sure I'll see it again sometime. Uh, the stock was not moving here. And the level two was moving, and the stock wasn't moving, and the bars weren't moving at all, and the candlesticks not on any platform I had. And then I checked with people in the room. It wasn't on theirs either. It was weird. It actually looked like the stock uh, wasn't open, and, and actually it looked like the stock was halted, except for the fact that the level two was moving. My concern was in, in doing anything immediately there was that the stock was actually something was wrong with it, that it really wasn't open or it wasn't, or it was going to get halted or something. And so I just stayed off of it till it got going, till I got the volume in it to wait to see if it was actually open. I believe that this was the opening price of the stock of the day. This is that this was the open. I don't think this was the open in here. I know it says 930, but stocks can open late. And I think that this was the open. The way that it acted, the way that it traded, the way that I saw this happen live, so it didn't hit me though till like like a couple of minutes, a couple of seconds. And then I read this live. Live in the real live moment, I read the swoosh. And then I decided to do it. And some people actually played through the swoosh. And if you played through the swoosh today and did the call that I made, uh, it was a huge, massive day for some people. The stock. High up here was 22.10, low down here was 20.31, this is almost $2, and if you played this, you just made $2 in less than five minutes. And stock rallied up, set up in here, and here's the trade. Now, this move here was basically a buck. So, just an incredible move in here, and a great, great, really great read by me to not only read the gap, to see that that gap was going to set up and work right, way early this morning, okay, and to see it and like it uh, way ahead of time, which I'm very good at doing, and then to see this in the live time and read the price in live time. I'm very, very good at reading price in live time. I'm amazing at it, and it's because I of the fact that I'm extremely detail-oriented in what I see in the price action, in the trading, and not only that, in the gaps, okay. The reason that I am excellent at trading the open and reading the open is because of my read on gaps. It's all together for me. It all goes together for me. I get the conviction from the gap and it allows me to read the price correctly then into the open, which means that I see something that's immediately going to work or I see an immediate failure. And that helps me too. It helps me stay off of something if I see it not working. Okay. But a great call by me today, me to you. And there were two things to watch today. Okay. I picked the best one. I usually do. Uh, and I, I'm just, I'm as excited today about the way that I read this and traded this today as much as the money that I made. 
I'm as I'm so proud of myself for seeing things so clearly. I I'm so so proud of myself for everything I've accomplished here and my way to develop my own system and to read live price action. There's there's no one that can read the open like me. I, I don't think there's anyone on the planet that can read the open as good in gaps as me. I am an expert in doing this, and I got to pat myself on the back on this today. And I think everyone that was with me in the room today that saw me call this and read it correctly uh, and did it was happy as a clam. So beautiful, beautiful, beautiful read on this today. And if you want to learn how to read price, and if you want to learn how to read gaps, and if you want to learn how to read institutional selling and buying, uh, then my class is the one to take. It is called the Golden Gap Class. It is this weekend, July 26th and 27th. Uh, from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Eastern Time, the cost of the class is $29.99. If you're interested and you want to sign up, email me at melissa at the I already have a bunch of people signed up. Uh, deadline's Friday at 5 o'clock. Today is Tuesday. So if you want to sign up for the class, email me. I can send you the information. Great stock swoosh here in ADU. And uh, very interesting today because I've never, never seen anything like it. And occasionally stocks do open late. And that's really what happened in this today. And 100% conviction that I liked this pick today and stayed with it and saw what I saw there. I, I, it is an absolute skill to be able to read that a stock is going to make a move in the day before it does it. To be able to see that a stock is going to do something before it does it is a skill that you can learn from me in the class. You take the class, you learn everything you can. Then you trade with me in the live room and through experience, then you're learning through the process of experience and being with me in the room. And today was an experience for people to be in the room with me today. And, and even for me to call it, and I never saw anything like this. And I've got to say that, you know, trading is one of these things that it's, it's just so special. It's just, it's just so special. It's so special. And if you really want to become successful as a trader, if you absolutely want to do it, if you really, really want it badly, uh, you will be led to, to, to someone like me to learn how to trade uh, because you can do it and you can make money doing this. And it is a skill and uh, I'm just, just so happy. I'm as excited today about how well I read this play as, as the money that I'm up in it. Just got to be honest with you here. And this is falling through here this afternoon as well. So all I went over here was the morning call. I'll do a wrap up on this final thing here once this is done today. Uh, but that was the morning play. I just wanted to go over for everyone for the stock swoosh that happened here in the morning. Uh, it's about 115. This looks great here right now. Um, this EDU, beautiful, beautiful golden gap today. And if you're interested in more information, email me at melissa at the stockswish.com. The best advice I can give to people who want to be successful trading the market is that, that you've got to really want to be good. You know, I love making the money. I absolutely love making the money. But I really, really, really like being good So and getting it right. And I think if you are focused on wanting to be good, the money's going to come. You know, it's just the way it is. Here this is falling through. Here this is following through, EDU. All right, I got to go here. But great, great morning for everybody. Uh, EDU is beautiful here. Right in here. Right in here. It still looks good. Have a great day, everyone, and email me at melissa at thestockswish.com if you'd like more information. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.